Hey guys, J Dog here, and um, today I just want to talk about a DMCC update and my thoughts on it. So uh, yeah, I never do these type of videos because I usually suck at doing it. But um, yeah. So if you enjoy, and then that's good. That's great, and I may do more in the future. But that's only if y'all enjoy it and that. But um, so MCC finally got updated yesterday. It's no longer, the insider program is over right now. That will continue when the next update comes, when they start to work on the next update. So, if you, like, you don't need the, ins the insider anymore. You, just, you can uninstall that. Unless you have enough space, then you can keep that in MCC. Because, uh, MCC, with this update that came out yesterday, it was pretty big. I think it was like 70 three gigabytes or something like that but yeah it, I would check but I'm using twitch so you wouldn't be able to see what I see if I back out the game this is what I have to work with I apologize but um yeah um so multiplayer it's down right now as you can see uh so is the Halo 5 Rex system from what Sketch said but they're looking into it. Whereas he said engineers and he had a picture of a rare Halo CE engineer, which I forgot those things were even a thing. Well, game general uh, Heath found those like I think a year ago or something or a few months back in the files of Halo CE, which is pretty cool. But anyway, um, multiplayer, last night, I was playing a lot of it, and finding games pretty fast, not gonna lie. Um, like, took 8 seconds and 10 seconds to find a match, and I would show you, but, uh, this just doesn't make the game look good when the servers are down. But yeah, but that's being worked on, uh... Hopefully it's fixed soon because I'm going to play some multiplayer. But, um, also, yeah, like, multiplayer, now, I've seen people still have issues with it, which we might be having the issue again where it works for some, but it doesn't work for others, which that shouldn't be the case. It should work for everyone, so free for free, you need to get on that, like, immediately. Before you even worry about adding any new features, or yeah, what well, they should fi like they should fix everything in the game before they add anything. Like there's still there's still issues in this game. There's still there's still some issues, but it's better now. It's not like it used to be. It's much better now. Um. Oh, and uh, now in custom games, you can join in progress like a. Uh, I tested this out last night with uh, a YouTuber named GamerJLE, awesome guy, I'll link his uh, channel in the description, check him out, he's amazing. Um, I was testing out if, because there, you can now basically join in progress in custom games, so I think they did that because the custom games for Alice will be coming. Uh, they sent an X update custom games for Alice will be coming. So that's good, nice. Along with light quality improvements, whatever that means. Maybe better customization for armor, I don't know. But anyway, um, the custom games browser, I mean, blah, the custom games are now joinable. Like, I was testing it out and uh, playing some uh, Blood Gulch by myself. And um, gamer, I asked Gamer J Lee to join, and he did, and it, it didn't notify me. Cause he told me in the older Halo games, they never notified you when someone joined, but it worked. He he joined, and it was pretty freaking awesome. So um, that was cool. Um, yeah. <laughs> so that that was cool. That that works now. I might be hosting some uh. I'm trying to think custom games sometime like a 
Halo CE custom games because that b fucking big team battle isn't in this, which sucks because I was really looking forward to that. But they did say that the reason all the game modes aren't in it at the most because the population isn't big, I guess. I, I mean, the population like is bigger than it was in the Insider, but because there's more people in it now, so it should have, you know, it. Anyway, it's going to be added soon, eventually, like Big Team Battle and Infection and all those modes that we come to love in the Halo games, unlike the Halo 5. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it'd be nice to play Blood Gulch and Big Team Battle, Death Island, Danger King, oh my, all these fucking maps are right here. These amazing maps. It'd be nice to, oh, like Sidewinder. Um, uh, Death Island, Danger Canyon, Infinity, Timberland, Icefields, I don't know what that, Phobia, I'm just gonna call it Phobia. Be nice to play those in Big Team Battle, just saying. Oh my god. And, um, now for me, the hit detection for all the games seem to be much better now. Even in Halo CE, it actually feels a bit better. There's still some wonkiness to it and that, but it feels better than it did before. Now, because it feels better for me, doesn't mean it'll feel better for everyone, so don't worry. I, I, can, I acknowledge that. I'm not stupid like I used to be. I understand that now, so don't worry. I, I know that it may work for me, but it won't work for others, which is stupid, but hey. Uh, might as well expect that with with this until it's fixed completely. Which there's more updates coming, so there you go. I'm sure free for free will get this fixed before the uh, uh, next update, though. Like before they start rolling it out, I'm pretty sure they might do some patches. But multiplayer for me works perfectly me and a uh, gamer Jay Lee again check that dude out if you haven't already um he and him were playing cus uh not custom games multiplayer last night we were playing uh halo 3 and halo 2 anniversary it's pretty fun although in halo 2 anniversary team arena we kept getting snipers like team snipers and it was just annoying like it, it says a mis mix of objective games, so you think it'd have Team Slayer, um, Capture the Flag, and all that other stuff, but no, it was just snipers. Should have just been called Halo 2 Snipers. Um, we didn't play the classic, though. I think we should have did that. But, um, yeah, so multiplayer works for some and doesn't for others. Free for free, get on that. Campaigns, they are much better now from what I play. They ain't, they don't really have that many issues. I really didn't have uh, issues with the campaigns, so I, I'm probably just talking nonsense. But <laughs> I never really had issues with the campaigns, so I mean, I. I can't really tell what's been fixed, but I heard there was issues, and I'm sure they've been fixed. Um, ODST, you can finally play that now in this new MCC, which is cool. Hoping to get Firefight and Reach. I mean, you know, they... I think Reach is gonna come. I think it is, but it's gonna be a while, so don't be expecting that. Like the Halo MCC PC port. Those may come. But just, you gotta wait a while. But they may come. Even though by then, <laughs> by then, Halo Infinite may be on horizon and people won't care anymore. But hopefully, it's not close to Halo Infinite's launch when they decide to do all that. But, um, yeah, campaigns, they work. They work. Um,. So, those two things work for me, and they may work for you, or not, who knows, but 
playlist they seem to have been fixed because I remember like exiting a playlist like saving it and going back into it and it would reset the playlist but that seems to be fixed and that's nice um customization still the same sadly <laughs> but we may get better customization in the future so don't worry Oh, and then you got the Halo 4 loadouts there. Uh, boof. Don't mind that name. I was just bored when I came up with that. Um. Oh, for the people who are in the Insider, we're going to be getting nameplates. Uh, I mean, if you care about that stuff, like, I mean, I, I it, it's going to be cool having the nameplate because we participate in the Insider, but. Eh. Wish we could have got something more than just a nameplate for that, like, like maybe a special armor or something, I don't know, but that's cool either way that we're getting a nameplate, and yeah. For you who haven't seen it, um, it looks cool, it looks pretty cool, it has MCC Insider on it, and there's another design with a weird things so inside I don't know I'll, I'll put a link to the waypoint post in the description again so you can see what I'm talking about because it's in that and yeah file share is the same um I haven't really messed with it even before this was updated so I don't know what they would have changed with this I heard that it needed a lot of updates like it needs fix which I can agree because this should be like the reach file share in my opinion where you can search for maps and clips or films and screenshots and game modes like that'd be cool settings um are all the same with just a new look oh oh no I don't want that <laughs> okay I don't know why it defaults it out the time um, slider, turns music up, turns it down, um, got that, languages is also new, you can change the language of the game and the text of the game to whatever language you want, although doing that will make the game update and that, so, yeah, and uh, voice, you can also, it, it's really, a, I played Halo 3 in Japanese a few days ago, and it was actually a pretty cool experience, it was like, I mean, it's not like, it's nothing special, but to me, it just felt a bit new playing Halo in a different language, it was a new type of experience for me, I need to have that all players, because I, there was actually people using game chat last night when I was on, which is awesome. That was nice to hear. I think proximity chat's been brought back because uh, on on Halo 3, when you go up to a red, like, I went up to this red guy and I heard him talking shit and I was like, what? And then when he killed me and I responded, I didn't hear him anymore, so that's pretty cool they brought that back unless that's been in the game and game chat just had them work because I heard game chat was broken too. But, uh, yeah, adjust brightness, that's a thing now. Um, subtitles, same, metal flash, the same, network ping, this and LAN. LAN is something that people have been wanting from what I've seen, so there you go, you got your LAN support. Uh, you got this now. I don't know what any of this means. I know that it's pain. So, yeah. It seems like that's not loading right. Oh, there we go. So, yeah, you got that. And then you got the intelligent delivery, which is pretty cool. But, um, I'm trying to think. It's cool and all, but I'm just... I'm really confused on what to do, because, like, I want to have all the games on here, but at the same time, it takes up so much space. I don't know which one to get rid of, because I know Halo 4 is not the best Halo game ever, but I like it, okay? I don't want to uninstall it in the multiplayer. 
But if I would have to, <laughs> I'd have to. And, um, hopefully Firefly gets added to the ESC, though, because that'd be cool to have that down there. To, like, toggle that on and off. But, uh, yeah, this is cool. You can do that. You can it, read up there if you want to see what it does. Um, yeah, so that's cool. Um, cool feature. I'm glad it's in the game. It's for those who have shitty internet and, and everything. And maybe if you're like me who have an Xbox One S and can't afford all the space, then, well, here you go. You can uninstall some of the games. Like multiplayer campaign, multiplayer and all that. If you want to look at... But if you want to install that and have that... Um, uh, in that, and trying to, mm. I, I don't, yeah, if you, ins like, look on the bottom, it says change, and then it tells you the size, and it, like, gives you space, which is cool, and yeah, this is a, this is pretty cool, I like it, but, I'm not really gonna use it that much, unless I add a Halo Reach to this, which, there's a slot open right there, so who knows. But, um, yeah, cool. And, really, oh, leaderboards. I heard these were broken, but, eh, I don't know. I never really used the leaderboards, so. Extras, Halo 5, still there, but there's a thing. This might become a game where all the Halo betas, like, I have a feeling 343 are gonna remove that and put the Halo Infinite beta there. And then the Halo 7 beta, and like, all the Halo betas will be on the MCC. All the mainline Halo betas, not the spin-off Halos, but, like, the games from Master Chief or is focusing on the main story will have betas in the MCC. Which is cool. It's cool. Um, Halo Nightfall, who... I forgot that even existed. That It wasn't great, not gonna lie. I mean, I, I liked it somewhat, but it wasn't great. It seems like every time they make a Halo movie or a little... Or a show or something, it doesn't do well. Hopefully that TV, that Showtime Halo show will do good. Because that's being directed by some... I think, I think Steven Spielberg still making it. And I think there's a few other people. But, um... Yeah, let me know in the comments who's, uh... Working on that. And, um... Yeah, and then that's... Really all there is to this. Nothing do really. I mean, you still have to go to Waypoint, or not Waypoint, the Halo Channel to fucking watch these, which is absurd. Because the Halo Channel is broken still, free for free. You might as well just get rid of it, people don't use it anymore. You might as well just make these available to watch in the MCC along with the Spartan Ops cutscenes. And yeah. <laughs> Credits.